having a great day. So today's video is going to be a little bit different than what you're used to seeing. I've decided to start doing weekly book reviews just because I want to share some of the information that I'm learning because it's all related to the happy lifestyle. Today I'm going to be talking about a book called The Happiness Equation and it's written by Neil Parisha who is a Canadian author. He's a Harvard graduate and he put this book together. It was actually a 300 page letter that he wrote to his uh, unborn son at the time. He was going through some challenges in his life and he was trying to figure out what makes people happy and what are ways that people can incorporate some practical things to help live a balanced and happy life. So what I did was I downloaded the book from Audible. Uh, and I listened to it and I just finished listening to it and it's absolutely fantastic. I just want to say that I love the practical tools that Neil gives you and he backs up a lot of his statement with a lot of research and studies that have been done. So that's a really neat thing too. Today I'm going to share some things that he mentions in his book on practical things that you can do in your life to help you live a more balanced, happy lifestyle. A few things that he encourages people to do on a daily basis is to go for walks. If you can't go every day, then at least three walks a week in the morning or in the evening just to get out into nature, clear your mind. He also encourages people to do a complete unplug. If you can put some time aside to completely shut your phone off, shut your computer off, the TV, anything that plugs into a wall basically and a good time to do this is before going to sleep so you can put your phone on airplane mode or you can just simply keep it all in another room just so you can really give your mind a break and just get into a relaxation mode which will help you in the next days ahead and help you not feel too stressed out it also says on a daily basis to do two minutes of meditation and all of that means is finding a quiet place closing your eyes, sitting comfortably, and simply listening to the sound of your natural breath. If you can do that for two minutes every day, it will completely give your mind a break from all of the activity and distractions that we experience every minute of the day. One of the last things that I'm gonna share with you that he says really helps you to feel happy and live a happy life is to have five gratitudes. And that means every day writing down five things that you're grateful and thankful for. It can be something big, it can be something small. I'm gonna do a separate video on a tool that I use to help keep my gratitudes consistent. Hope some of these tips helped. I really, really encourage you to pick up the happiness equation, give it a read, download it from Audibles, listen to it in your car. It, it's really, really helpful and it's just a really positive book to read. Hope you guys like this video. Leave a comment below. Let me know what you think of this video. If, if you have any questions or comments or maybe you read the happiness equation, I'd love to hear your thoughts and what you thought about it. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe. See you in the next video. Bye.